Moonlight delves into the life of a man named Chiron. The movie is split into three parts, showing him as a kid, a teenager, and a man. Growing up in Miami, Chiron didn't have the most hospitable life, living with a drug-addicted mother and getting bullied constantly. But a couple of people would make some positive impacts on him. There's one, a drug dealer with a heart of gold, who becomes a father figure to Chiron. And then there's Kevin, who grows up with Chiron and very often encourages him. The two of them later share a tender moment with each other at the beast when they're teenagers. But a couple of risks would still be caused by Chiron's mother and bullies respectively. In my opinion, this was a superb movie that gives an excellent look at someone trying to find his identity and is emotionally effective from beginning to end. The camera work and the performances are all top notch, along with a hauntingly beautiful score. The big standout is Mahershala Ali in his wonderful performance as Juan. Even though Chiron is very self-protective and reserved, he slowly puts his guard down and forms a relationship with Juan and his girlfriend Teresa, played by Janelle Monet, who I found very enjoyable in Hidden Figures, which also starred Mahershala Ali. Back to Ali, in a very beautiful scene where Juan teaches Chiron how to swim, Ali actually taught the boy who played young Chiron, Alex Hibbert, since he couldn't swim in real life. You can even see the influence Juan had on Chiron when he follows in Juan's footsteps as an adult. Even though he's only in the first third, Mahershala Ali certainly makes the most with his presence on screen, ending on a heartbreaking note. A well-deserved Oscar-winning performance indeed. Significantly, the title comes from the story Juan tells Chiron on how a Cuban woman saw him as a boy in Moonlight and calls him Blue. Also, Chiron and Kevin's intimate moment at the beach takes place at night, so they're bathing in moonlight too. The way you hear waves crashing whenever Chiron thinks of that fateful night was very clever. I won't go into any more detail because I don't think I could do this movie any more justice. But by and large, Moonlight is a brilliant character study that is ultimately breathtaking in its characterization and sentiment. It shows the harsh reality that people like Chiron go through, which then leads to a very powerful and open-ended conclusion. I am giving Moonlight my complete approval. Now fellas, I know for the past few months you've been competing with each other, and you receive a lot of critical acclaim and a lot of awards. And what happened that night at the Oscars was very unfortunate. You didn't deserve to have half of your moment taken away because of that dreadful mistake. And you certainly didn't deserve to be humiliated that way. But you want to know something? You're both very special movies. You provide great themes about following your dreams, and you are a love letter to Hollywood. And you provide great themes about self-identity. And all the hate that you're getting from people, I just want you to know that they're just jealous of all the love and attention that you're getting. But you deserve an equal amount of love too. Just be grateful that you two were created by two extraordinary directors who wanted to get your stories across. I praise you both because you are fearfully and wonderfully made. <laughs>